Hi guys and welcome to One Man One Life. Well today we're gonna clean my station car. We've got um, a few different products to try. We've got some snow foam from Amazon I think I bought it. I've got a, a buffer polisher, electric polisher, so we're gonna try that. Um, we've obviously got the Meguiar's wax and some Fuso paint protector. So I've got a Nissan Leaf which I use to drive to the station and back because you wouldn't want to do much else in it. So let's get the Porsche moved and bring the Nissan Leaf in. And then we'll get to, we'll get to work. See what you think of all the different products. I also forgot to mention that um, we got a new Karcher Jet Washer K2. So I've had a, a McAllister before that, which has been great, but all the pipes perished. And it was as dear to buy the pipe and the lens as it was to buy a new Karcher. So I thought I'll give a new Karcher a go. So we'll have a look at that as well. Anyway. Let's do a cold start on the Porsche and get it out of the way and get the Nissan in. Let's get it moved. I'm just going to throw it on, on the road somewhere while I move the other one. Then we'll um, then we'll swap them back. So just got to negotiate all this crazy traffic. All right, so we'll get this in. We'll have a look, quick look around it. Then we'll, um, as you can see, it doesn't make a sound. It's actually all right as a car, but for one, it looks terrible. It does about 120 miles to the charge. And two, it doesn't make a sound. What's the point in that? Right, that's some swapped over. Let's have a look. As you can see, it's been sat on the road since this lockdown. And it's in a pretty grotty mess. I mean, look at those cobwebs there. Madness. Wheels are a mess. So let's get let's get clean. So first of all, what we got? We got a electric polisher and a leaf blower. I will use a leaf blower to blow all the water out the joints so that when I put the wax on we don't get runs all over it. And then we've got, oh, we've got a new wax cloth there. So that is brilliant. That really gets all the grime and everything out the wash. Then we've got a Karcher jet wash. And we've got some screen clean. And this is the snow foam which we'll be trying for the first time today so I'll let you make your own mind up how good it is that's just car shampoo and then with the bottles one's full of car shampoo the other one's for the snow foam then we got some Meguiar's wax but before we put that on we'll put some 
Fuso Marishan, which is absolutely brilliant. And there's a bag of all the clean cloth. So let's get to it. Well guys, it's quite finished, we've had a wash, a snow foam, a clay pie, a wax, we've used the um, leaf blower and all the panels to make sure we've got all the water out so it doesn't dribble out later, then we give it a, a buff, snow foam I think is great but watch the video and see what you think so I caught new culture as well that's good it's very light mm. a lot lighter than the um, calister I had so it's, it's easy to move about the only drawback I would say to it is the pipe from the culture to the to the land so the gun whatever you want to call it very short I think I might go online and buy a 10 metre one because you have to constantly keep moving the, the carcher. Anyway, we'll have a quick look around the car now. It's lovely and shiny. Um, hope you enjoy this video. As you can see, Beautifully shiny. Oh, you can see the Porsche in the background. So there she is until next week when we'll give her another clean. No clear by next week though, we'll just polish it and keep going. Anyway, there she is, 
on this and leave 120 miles to a charge use it for the station basically I'm collecting stuff from B&Q because I don't want to put that in the Porsche anyway take care give us a thumbs up hit the bell for notifications and we'll see you in the next video bye